quite well. It's often if, if there's a change in, in seemingly a change in the personality or something like that, you know. So. Uh, the main symptoms of depression are usually quite low mood, low energy, uh, no motivation to do things, and often quite terrible thoughts of self-harm or suicide. Feeling pretty down and low, um, things not worried. going right for you, and you feel that you're not worthy of doing what you're supposed to be doing or sometimes uh, you feel insecure. I think it is, yeah, um, to some extent. I think not, not just amongst the media, I, I, I think um, when I said to someone they were suffering from depression, they, they got quite um, uptight about it and in, in, in denial, you know, so I think I think even amongst ourselves, I think we don't want to admit it sometimes and admit that we need help. I think there's a very, sort of, people don't know enough about it. It's not so much of a negative stereotype, but people don't know enough about the illness. Yes, definitely, yes. definitely. Yes. Even with them, people who are looking for work, if they admit to employers that they've got they've suffered with depression, a lot of a lot of impre uh, employers wouldn't. They'll probably interview them, but they wouldn't take them on in the job. Well, I think they have. People sure like Stephen be. Fry and people like that have brought a great awareness to people, but I still think there is a stigma, and uh, I do think people in general should talk about it more. Yeah, yeah. I think if it was talked more. about, then... Um, I don't know if you agree, Brian, but I think if it was talked about more, it would be like any other illness. More acceptable, yeah. perhaps. Yeah. 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 yeah.